guys, welcome back. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you guys and I'm so excited. I'm actually breaking this haul down into two parts. So today you'll see part one, which is the new spring storage and organizers that are out at the DT right now. Like, Isn't that just like one of the most wonderful times of the year? Well, I sure do think that it is, and I'm super excited to share it with you guys. So again, part one is going to be storage and organizers, and then part two is going to be all of the new spring items that I picked up. Ugh, cannot wait to show you guys. So definitely, if you are new, this is your first time tuning in. Hey guys, I'm Bianca. I love shopping at the DT and you definitely want to subscribe for more videos and to be notified when I upload part two to this haul. So let's get started. This color right here, oh my goodness. So if you've been with me since last year, I picked up a lot of the same containers in pink, blue, and white last year. Or the blue that they had out last year was more of like a turquoise, like more of like that deep blue green versus this is more of like an aqua or a Tiffany blue. So I revamped my pantry last year on Snapchat during spring break and it is still, it's still in good shape. But when I saw this color, I love this color so much more. It's lighter and brighter and I just I couldn't say no so I picked up a lot of storage containers in this color because I'm going to be switching out my pantry to the Tiffany blue and I'm going to pull out all of those containers that I currently have in my pantry and find another use for them okay so again let's just get started oh my goodness I'm just obsessed with this color so the first little organizer that I picked up are these little lock top snack containers. You get a two pack for a dollar. I hauled these or I picked up a lot of these like end of summer, early fall, like right when it was like back to school time. These are perfect to hold your kiddos crayons. I absolutely love these containers. The lock is super easy to open and close, but with that being said, it's not too easy where it's just going to pop open. It is definitely kid friendly. It's the perfect little size if you're packing your little ones lunch and you want to put their little snack in here or in your craft area. Again, perfect for crayons. I do sell decals that will fit the front of this perfectly. So if you wanted to order some of those, I'll leave the link to, or it's not the link, I will leave my Instagram down below or my email where you can email me to order the decals. But you can definitely get your child's name to fit across the top. Or if you know you're gonna put tags, sequins, glitters, I can literally make a decal that says anything. So. These little containers, they're just so much bang for your buck. Two for a dollar, you cannot go wrong. I'm using these in my pantry, which is why I picked them up in this color. Love them. I also picked up these little round containers with the lid. Don't know what I'm gonna use them for. I'm definitely not using them for like sugar, rice, or flour because I already have like amazing containers, like the little ones where you like pop up the lid and they seal like really tight. But maybe like for the little bags of oatmeal. I don't know. I just, I don't know yet. But I know when I start, or I know especially last year, whenever I started to reorganize my pantry, I was like, oh, I wish I, I wish I would have had one more tub or I wish I would have bought those other items. So definitely picked these up. I will find a use for these, no doubt. Okay, the next containers that I picked up are these. I absolutely love this size so much. I love that you can see through them, how they have these little polka dots. They also have these little like tabs right here where you can stack them on top of each other. Maybe you want to use these under your sink. Maybe you want to use them in the laundry room to store rags or dryer sheets, your Tide Pods, whatever. These are just perfect for stacking or I mean just perfect to add on your shelf to get organized to some people it's too much like why like why organize it? it's already in a box or whatever but to each their own for me I personally love looking in my pantry seeing that every item has a spot it has its own designated place it's clean it's organized 
and it's so much easier to look at and actually want to cook or actually want to grab a snack instead of just running to the store, instead of saying like, let's go out to eat tonight. Don't get me wrong, my pantry does not always look like it's from Pinterest. It definitely has its days. It's not always perfect. And that's the thing, I don't organize my pantry or buy these little containers, organizers, for my pantry to be perfect. I want it to be user friendly. I don't want it to just look pretty because that's not a reality. Pretty on Pinterest, definitely, but I've definitely learned with organizing last year with the containers, sometimes the functionality isn't there and I have to reorganize it or rethink what I'm doing because I definitely want it to look nice because again, you want to cook. You definitely want to use what you have in your pantry, especially when you see it, but I definitely want it to be user-friendly, not just for me because I'm not the only one using or putting stuff back in my pantry. So when you find the right function for each little basket, it's super easy for others in your family to be able to continue to keep up what you have going on in your pantry, which is definitely important for me because I'm not the only one using, getting things out of, or putting things back into my pantry. So trial and error with these little containers and I just love them. I love putting labels on my containers or now I don't really use labels but I make vinyl decals and for these you can't really do that but what you can do is you can tie a little tag and then have your tag hang off so that your family members know what goes in each basket whether they're looking for a certain snack or when others are restocking your pantry. So love these containers. And I just thought that I would go ahead and just throw in some tips and tricks and why I do what I do and just like share some ideas and tips with you guys because I get a lot of questions of why do you do it? Why do you buy those containers? What's the point? And it really works for me. It may not work for everyone and I just hope that you're watching this and you'll be able to take something from it. You don't have to go out and buy these same exact containers. Maybe you have things around your house that you can use. Also, since I did do it last year and it was trial and error, I did use some tubs for maybe bread or certain items and two weeks went by and it was like, you know what, that wasn't a good idea for that container and I did have to switch some things up. So if you're following me on Snapchat, you will probably see my pantry get reorganized. I did get a lot of like questions or a lot of like video suggestions of filming it. I just feel like the pantry is just such a tough area to film. Like to get in every nook and cranny, it's so dark to try to fit like my ring light or lights. It's just, it's not ideal. So if you are following me on Snapchat, you probably will see my pantry get reorganized. Okay, so the next little containers that I picked up are these little tubs. They do, these are like the little locker bins. So on this side, I don't know if you can tell. They kind of have like this little locker look to them, but on the other side, they do not, which is perfect for a label or a decal, which is what I'm definitely going to do with these. I love this size container. I think I forgot to mention, I picked up five of the little sets with the little polka dots and I picked up four of these. Okay, next up, these little storage containers. I love them. Now last year I had only picked up one because I didn't know what I was going to do with it and I absolutely love storing like the little bags of chips in here. It is perfect. You see all of the chips that you have. It fits perfectly on the shelf and I wish that I would have picked up one more last year. So this year I have two because I'm going to put all of the chips in one and then next to it I'll be able to fit all of these snacks. I love how wide these are. They're super great for parties. If you already have your chips and you already have your snacks in these, you're having a party, you're making burgers, you're making hot dogs, you pull out your container and it's already ready to go. They're already set up. I love the way the chips sit and lay in here. It maximizes space. I did try putting chips in this size container last year and it just didn't work out. The buckets are too high, so you have to like double stack them on top of each other and it turns into a hot mess. So these are perfect for storing chips and snacks. 
Okay, next up I picked up three of these containers. So they're very similar to this little size. However, these are square and these are rectangular. And I wish so bad that I could find more of these. I would have picked up six. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to use my white buckets like this that I picked up last year along with these because I need at least six for my bottom shelf. I love these containers. They're perfect for storing bread. They're perfect for storing like extra paper towels, napkins, extra plasticware. These are just the perfect size because they're a lot slimmer, but they're a lot longer. These are just perfection. I only have three and I am on the hunt for more. Okay, next up are more storage bins and these are the collapsible storage containers and I picked up four of them. Now last year I did not pick these up in the matching color and I needed to because I was using containers like this at the very bottom of my pantry. It's like right underneath the last shelf. I have a ton of space that could be used and these are going to be perfect. I would have bought one more but this is all they have. I bought that one Dollar Tree out. I have gone to countless Dollar Trees to try to find more and no luck. But I'm so glad that I did get to pick up four of these. They are a 10 and a half inch by 11. Now they're not the most sturdiest little cube containers ever. The ones at Target and Walmart that are about six to seven dollars a piece are definitely a lot more sturdy. These are only a dollar. So if you're using these and you're actually putting heavy items in it, number one, I don't recommend that. And number two, if it's the only container you have and you need to use it, I recommend that you don't pull it from the handle. So if you have this down in your pantry or your closet or wherever you have it and you have a heavier item in it, don't pull it by the handle because it will rip. But if you wanted to store maybe like your plastic containers or your plastic Tupperware, just something super light, it'll definitely work for those items. Just you have to be a little careful with them. Like, oh, look how pretty all of this is. I'm just so excited. But moving on, I did pick up some pink containers. So I love this embossed flower here. This is so pretty. They also have this design in that color, but I could not find them anywhere. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I wanted them so bad, but I could not find them, but I did find the pink. So I picked the pink up. I picked up four of these. These are the perfect containers. I use them in my wardrobe. I picked them up last year. They were more of a hot, hot pink. I don't know if you how it's coming off on camera how pink it is here I would say it's more of a bubblegum pink versus last year was like a super hot deep pink and I used half of them here and I took half of them to work so I think I'm gonna bring the ones from work home and switch my work ones out with these and I picked up three of these these are like paper size maybe a little bit longer and I love them. They're gonna fit perfectly on the shelf. Just, I'm super excited about these. So I picked up three of these and again, four of these. And I also picked up two of the pink storage collapsible containers. And I don't know what I'm gonna use these for yet. I'm thinking about using them in my closet. I did have one of the hot pink ones from last year, but I have learned my lesson. You don't buy items in one at the Dollar Tree, especially like this. When you have one, I promise you, you will always want another. So I picked up two and I will find a use for them. Okay, next up, these little acrylic look-alike containers. Oh my goodness, I have been on the hunt for these and I finally found a few. I picked up one, two, three, four, five. I picked up five of these. These are amazing to put in your Alex 5 drawers if you have them. I did use one of these in my Organize With Me. I did organize my foundation, concealer, and primer drawer. I will leave the link to that video down below if you've missed it or if you want to watch it. These are just perfect. They're perfect for storing powders, lipsticks, blushes, you name it. 
even if you don't want to use it in your beauty room, maybe you want to use it for your crafting area, perfect for storing tags, list pads, page flags. Maybe you want to use this in your pantry. Maybe you want to use this to organize your kitchen. I mean, the ideas, the possibilities with these are endless, but just perfect for organizing. And then my last two items, I only found one of each of them. Oh, and I wish I could have found more. I picked up this little square organizer with lid. I'm going to go ahead and open it up for you guys. Okay, here it is. Oh, it is perfection. The little lid pops off and back on. Perfect for storing anything. Crafting materials, planner supplies, makeup. This is like a great size container to maybe store like your everyday makeup items. Cotton balls, cotton pads, q-tips to maybe like set on your vanity area in your restroom. If only I could have gotten more of these. So I don't know necessarily what I'm going to use this one for because there's only one and you know I want at least two, but I'm going to find a use for it. And then this little organizer right here. Ugh, perfection. Like these will sit perfectly in the Alex 5 drawers and I just, I love it. Let me go ahead and open it up. Okay, so this is perfect to set on your vanity, maybe on your desk your vanity by your restroom to put your everyday makeup items like so. Oh my goodness. This is just an amazing deal. I know that they had the little organizers for lipsticks. This little size right here is a little bit too big for one lipstick, but you could definitely add probably two to three lipsticks in each container. They were advertising this more for fingernail polish, but this is just such an amazing deal for a dollar. Yes, please. Alrighty, well, that is a wrap for this haul. All of the new storage containers, organizers out at the DT right now, they have them in this blue, pink. They do have a lighter purple, lime green, red. <sighs> You really need to get to a DT ASAP. These babies sell out so fast. Alrighty, well, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to be notified when part two of this haul comes out. You definitely want to see all of the new spring stuff out at the DT. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye, guys.